Hello beautifuls, I'm Dr. Jasmine Chanel and thank you so much for tuning into my channel today. First I have to tell you, you can have beauty and you can have brains. Don't let society tell you anything else, it is possible to have both. But to get back to our main topic today, we're going to learn how to cut kitty nails because cats are awesome but you do have to deal with their nails. And I want to show you how to cut a cat's nails by yourself um, with no scratches, no bites, and they might even enjoy it. So let's learn something new today. So one of the main questions people ask uh, about their cat and the nails are, one, do cats like getting their nails cut? And two, can I do it myself? And the answer is yes, they can grow to like getting their nails cut. And yes, you can do it yourself. So it's definitely like a win-win type of situation. So the first thing you want to do before you even start uh, <laughs> trying to cut your cat's nails is get the treats ready. Whatever treats they like. You can see she really likes these. So I use Temptations. And you want it to be a positive experience. So before you even begin, you can go ahead and just give them one. Like, you know, so they know what they're going to be getting later on. So you want to start it off like, oh, this is fun. Aren't you enjoying this? Yes, you are. So for many of you, this might be the first time you're actually touching your cat's nails uh, or their paws. So the first thing I like to do is just massage the paws. So I'll just massage the paws. And you can see I have her cradled like this, like a baby. And I'll massage her tail. I'll massage one foot. And I'll massage the other foot. Okay, I don't have any more. You can see she's really expecting it. Um, <laughs> so that's what you'll do first. And most cats, if you're feeding them treats, they don't really care what you're doing with their paws. Okay, so the next thing you gotta do is identify where the nails are located. And for cats, they're really interesting because they have retractable claws. That means they can pull them back, um, they can pull them back in and let them out. And you can see she's kind of, she's doing that right now. So on the hind limbs, um, again, you'll just push the foot out, to push the toes out, um, and the nails will come out and then release and they'll go back. So before we begin, I just want to talk about the product that I use to actually cut her nails. Um, this one's by Bamboo, and there are many brands that make this nail, uh, a nail cutter similar to this. Um, I really like it because it's just got a little hole right here where they're their nail will, will go through like so. And it's also got on the reverse side like a little kit. So she's ready to get her nails cut, but not yet, not yet, not yet. Um, it has a little kit, so there's a nail file in here and there's also silver nitrate. And silver nitrate is commonly used if you accidentally um, cut, cut the quick. So you just pull this out and like, I just got a ton of powder um, on me, but um, I don't know if you can see it in there. If your cat did or your dog, you did accidentally cut the quick and the quick being on um, the vascular portion of the nail. So like, it'd be the same if you cut your quick, then you can just put a little bit of this on there and it'll help um, the blood coagulate and stop bleeding. So it's good to have on hand, um, but I rarely need it, especially with cats because you can see the nail really clearly. So you shouldn't, um, you shouldn't hit it. So we're just going to get her positioned and then we're going to begin. Good girl. And you can talk to him while you do it. And you can see where the nail is um, transparent. So you'll just go right there, right where the nail is transparent and gently cut. You don't have to cut off a lot. And I normally leave enough room just so I don't worry about hitting the tip. Um, you can also see they have like a little thumb here, so you don't want to forget that nail as well. So you'll gently just move that one and cut that as well. Yes, yes. And then I gently give her a treat. So as you can see, we've got nice little cut nails now. You can see they're, um, they're not pointed at the tip now, they're shorter. And they look gorgeous. Yes, they do. 
So thank you all for watching my video today. I'm hoping that you learned something and you and your cat can grow to enjoy this wonderful, wonderful skill that you've learned. Um, also, they'll get a lot of treats and you all will get to bond and their nails will be shorter. It's just a win-win for everybody. Um, also, if you have any other videos you'd like for me to show you how to do, maybe cut dog's nails. I have a Rottweiler named Sheba Milan Sunrise who gets her nails cut and she has black nails. So it's a little bit different than cutting my cat's nails um, and she's a lot bigger so I had to train her to actually give me her paw. Um, I'd be happy to show you how to do that as well or if you have any other questions or movies you'd like me to do. Thank you all so much and you can follow me on Instagram at Dr. Underscore Jasmine Chanel or visit my website for frequently asked questions, tips on fashion and food at www.drjasmine.com. Thank you all beautiful and have a wonderful day.